Well, you all saw it was an inevitable sentence. Um, there was no discretion by the judge, as he stated. And I know that the judge felt that I was re-arguing the motion for a new trial, but there was a reason why I stated it again, because the issue was so important and the issue was so germane to our justice system. And in essence, what happened here, and as I said this, before I met any of you, this case was simply an inquisition. It was a show trial, and how it ended is exactly perfect for that description, in that it didn't make a difference what the jury saw, what they said, what they discussed, what they voted on. At the end of the day, all that mattered was the government's evidence, no matter how flawed it may have been, no matter how many lunatics and sociopaths and psychopaths that it depended on. All that mattered was the evidence and the jury be damned. We learned that up to five jurors broke the law, violated the law while they were judging Mr. Guzman for crimes. And nevertheless, we couldn't even get a hearing to determine what actually happened because as we all know, had we had that hearing, had we had that hearing, chaos uh, would have ensued and we would have been back here for round two. And that was something that the United States government could never have. They fought desperately against it. And that's why the judge ended this with a, a very uh, quickly written and canned 43-page opinion, which will now be part of the appeal and probably the most significant appeal issue.